The AVA was an association called, uh, it was Friends of the American Veterans, uh, Amid as Veteran Americain, uh, meaning friends, friends, in English, Friends of the American Veterans. And she founded the organization and uh, was the original president of it and uh, continued on with it th throughout her life until she passed away and uh, had many members who uh, liked to pay the respects to Americans who liberated their area and they decorated the graves of the American boys killed in action that were buried in St. Mary Glees. Actually, prior to the founding of the AVA, uh, you know, the association, she herself went and tended to the graves and had other people in the town, would bring flowers and plant them on the graves of the American boys and, and then uh, another lady would come up and sort of adopt a grave. And this continues to happen uh, all over England and France and Holland and Belgium and where, where they have American boys and, and young students will write a letter and to me and say, do you know who uh, Sergeant Billy Jones was or that sort of thing? And we'll do research and we'll find out. And that young boy or that young girl, to this day, in England or France or Holland, uh, will write letters and they adopt that soldier and will write to his family or now grandchildren or children of that man that was killed or the, the, the nephew or, or niece. And Madame Raynaud started this by writing letters and originally. So, and, and then other people got involved, other women in the town and other women from the area. Then it spread out. So when they opened the Colville or Saint Laurent Omaha Beach Cemetery uh, and took all of the bodies of the American boys that were killed and put them in the graves at Omaha Beach, which is the most beautiful cemetery right on the ocean, uh, Omaha Beach uh, battleground, where there's 9,385 American boys buried there. And a great majority have uh, a sponsor or a child, a man or a woman, or somebody in the family that has adopted that grave. And Madame Renault started this like in, 19, in 1944, 1945, by having other women come and plant flowers and pay their respects because she saw these boys give their life for their freedom and for our freedom too.